In the small town of Elmwood, nestled among rolling hills and shimmering lakes, lived a young boy named Oliver. He had always felt like an outcast at school, an invisible presence lost in a sea of conformity. The other children never understood his quirks and passions, and he often found solace in his own world of imagination. One sunny afternoon, as Oliver wandered aimlessly through the meandering streets, he stumbled upon a weathered building tucked away between two towering oak trees. It was a place he had never noticed before, the Elmwood Music Academy. Intrigued, he pressed his ear against the heavy wooden door and was greeted by a symphony of melodies dancing through the air. Curiosity ignited within Oliver's chest as he turned the doorknob, entering a realm where dreams and reality intertwined. The Academy's hallway was adorned with faded photographs of famous musicians, their eyes filled with an undeniable passion. He could almost hear the echoes of the melodies whispering tales of triumph and determination. Oliver ventured further into the heart of the Academy following the alluring strains of music that led him to a small practice room. Through the door's narrow window, he glimpsed a figure hunched over a piano, their fingers dancing across the keys with grace and precision. He pushed open the door and stepped inside, the scent of polished wood and aged sheet music filling his senses. The figure turned, startled by his presence, revealing a man with graying hair and kind, twinkling eyes. His name was Professor Alexander Bennett, a renowned pianist in his prime, now dedicating his life to nurturing young talents. Can I help you, young man? the professor asked, his voice rich with warmth. Oliver hesitated, his heart pounding in his chest. I, I, I heard the music, and it drew me here. I've always wanted to play, but I never had the chance. The professor smiled, beckoning Oliver to join him at the piano. Music has a way of finding those who need it most. Sit down, my boy, and let your fingers tell their story. Oliver tentatively placed his hands on the keys, his fingertips tingling with anticipation. As he struck the first chord, a surge of emotions coursed through his veins. The music began to flow, carrying him away on its ethereal wings. The professor watched in awe as Oliver's talent unfolded before his eyes. The boy's fingers danced across the keys with an innate understanding of harmony and rhythm. With each note, his confidence grew and the melodies he played resonated with a depth beyond his years. Days turned into weeks and weeks into months. Oliver dedicated every spare moment to the piano, pouring his heart and soul into each practice session. One evening, as Oliver concluded a breathtaking performance in the Academy's Grand Auditorium, he was met with a standing ovation. The room thundered with applause reverberating through his very being. Tears of joy welled in his eyes as he realized he had finally found his place in the world, a place where he was celebrated and embraced. Professor Bennett approached Oliver, his voice filled with pride. My dear boy, you possess a gift that can move mountains and heal hearts. Never doubt the power of your music. Embrace it and let it carry you to unimaginable heights. <laughs> 